The International Defense Exhibition is one of the world's biggest arms fairs, with more than 60,000 military delegates attending. But China is once again making a strong presence at this year's exhibition in Abu Dhabi. Mavish Khan has this report. A true show of force by China, as the Asian country's pavilion houses some 35 exhibitors. China Defense has come out guns blazing with eight vendors under its banner. Among the big names, China's largest arms manufacturer, China North Industries, or Norinco, and the country's leading defense company, Poly Technologies, both showcasing state-of-the-art military hardware. On offer from Norinco is the universal artillery launcher, known as the SR-5. Used in combat, the system is fitted with pods on a truck that allows it to fire rockets in two configurations. The tense geopolitical situation in the Arab region underscores the importance of the Defense Expo for weapons manufacturers like Norinco. The Middle East market is one full of challenges and opportunities. Demand for high-tech weapons is leading the international market. Meantime, Poly Technologies is rolling out the CSVP3 mine-resistant ambush-protected vehicle. As shown in this demonstration, once a landmine is planted, the vehicle has the ability to withstand an explosion of up to 16 kilograms of TNT, all the while keeping the soldiers inside safe, a powerful defense on the front lines of modern warfare. Military trade cooperation will be broadly carried out with other countries within international laws and national policies. We're showcasing products and systems which meet the demand of Middle East and neighboring region. We're displaying some defense systems of anti-air, anti-terrorism, and anti-explosion. As the international defense exhibition continues to grow, so too does participation from countries like China. And with various military hardware on offer, they're becoming more visible on the scene here in Abu Dhabi. Mavish Khan, CCTV, Abu Dhabi.